same way we came. Poetically. Exodus. In this forum known as poetry, I'm here to be all I can be, cause I'm carrying on the Jesus mission. Armed with words which perform acrobatic miracles, flopping in and out of psyches, and light these heads like bulbs within. You ask, can a man really walk on water? Well, I'm here and now walking on you and yours, outro the door and into a land of nah, otherwise known as <laughs> hip-hop, jazz, gospel, R&B. It's all poetry where kids like me speak with daggers and write with pens which spew souls from the tips. Verbal connoisseurs take sips and watch me transform from chrysalis. Picture this. Yes. Smooth as black is in my brown sugar dream. Yeah. Pulled out a strand of my hair, I think I mean. I think I found the wrinkle link to my mother. You see, nappy, kinky, or whatever you perceive me to be. I'm tired of walking through the elements of life silently, waiting for something or someone to inspire me. So today, I inspire myself, enticing you with the jagged edge of collected threads and sharpened leads, just waiting to be stroked by verse. First, I'd like to lose myself in the mounds of freedom as we gather our souls in a place of peace. It's the seven-letter veteran. Terrell. Never settle for less. How do you leave a gathering? Exit stage left. Like the Israelites creeping through the wilderness. Yes, yes. yes. But this time, no golden calf. And on behalf of the prophets, we came to bring the math. And lead them down the path to break bread. Enough said. Hybrid tongues on the exodus. Y'all. Bobbing on the exodus. Bobbing on the exodus. Mr. <laughs> Diddy.
peace, family. Yo, thank you for joining us, right? And I'm thrilled to announce the fact that we are now releasing our first free e-course. Come and learn about Giambi's journey. See some of the stuff we do. Come and join the tribe. Tribe up with us and check out the free e-course. And make sure that the URL pop up right about here. And it'll probably be somewhere in here. Check us out, family, because we are building. Come and learn about Gianni's journey. And let's build together. One of the most frequent questions that I get is, where are the children and why you, self, why you call yourselves the children of the sun? I am a genius. My ancestors were geniuses. My ancestors have made me a genius in all that I think, say, and do. I must declare myself a genius. I am a genius. Whenever I am myself, I practice my geniusness and do great things. All my thoughts, choices, and deeds must express my geniusness. I am a genius. My decisions must always be in the best interest of myself, my family, my people, and my God. Only then will I and everyone I know know that I am a genius. I am a genius. At all times, my geniusness must reflect my culture. My geniusness must serve my God. My geniusness must make me be one in love and harmony with my family. My geniusness must protect my people. Yes. yes, at all times I must demonstrate excellence because I am a All right, it's time for the Toast family. Come on out, let's get it. Trying to be right. Take the toast. Good morning. Media G and J Media. We are doing the daily women, but the most important goddesses were black, not just for the African now, in the civilization of the Greeks. The Greeks were so profoundly affected by the Africans that the goddess of chastity was a black woman, Artemis. The goddess of wisdom was a black woman, Minerva. 
The goddess of beauty was a black woman, Diana, and many of their great mythological figures which were critical to the vision of history, the history of the Greeks in the Odyssey, the woman who draws, who has the power to draw Odysseus and all his crew into her, is Circe, who is represented as a black woman with African features on the Greek vases. The woman who helps Jason win the Golden Fleece is a black woman, Medea. The woman who marries Perseus, the Greek hero, What is a lion without his pride? What is a whale without his pie? What is a monkey without his troop? What is a wolf without his pack? The answer is very simple. They are the same thing that a human being is without a try. Pray. Oh, it's time to Grab drink. Grab the glass, it's family, it's time for us to get started. I'm so excited. Sitting up here, Kid Magic. Kid Magic Rock. Mm. Shots out. Here we go. Drink your water. Come on, come on. Drink your water, but first. Then drink some water. Take your breath. Take your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Take, it. Take, Take it. your breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Drink, 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 drink. drink or should I say, breathe, breathe, then drink. Take a breath. Take a breath. Take your breath. Take now. Your breath. Grab your glass for some water. Grab your glass. Lift your picture of that water. Pour a bottle. Get that picture of that water. Uh -huh. Simply pour, pour some, some water. water. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should water. I say, lift, pour, then drink. Now move your body and drink some water. Move your body. Move your body and drink some water. Move your body. Move your body and drink some water. Bam. Just move your body. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should I say, move, move, then drink. Move your body. Now raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors, fam. Just raise your glass. Drink, 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 drink. Drink your water. Or should I say, raise, toast, then drink. Take your 
breath and drink some water. Take your breath. Lift and pour yourself some water. Pour. Move your body, drink some water. Move it. Raise your glass and toast your ancestors. Breathe, lift, move, toast. But remember to stay healthy. Remember the four pillars. Breathe, drink, eat, move. Drink half your weight in ounces. Eat a culture before we die. Behave. Take your breath. Come on. Lift and pour. You can do it. Move your body. Come on. Come on. Toast your ancestors. Drink up. Come on. Drink it. Drink it. Drink it. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Drink it. Lift and drink it. Come on. Drink that health in. Drink. 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 Drink your water. Take your breath. Take your breath. Take your breath. Lift and pour. Lift it. Move your body. Come on. Come on. Toast your ancestors. Drink. 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 Drink your water. Drink. 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 Come on. Drink your water. Take your breath. Lift it. Pour. Come on, pour it. Move your body. Come on. Toast your ancestors. Drink, 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 drink. What? Drink your water. Drink. Drink your water. Drink your water, family. Drink your water, family. Drink your water. Drink your water. Drink your water. Hey. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. And you know what? It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day in the neighborhood. Would you be right? Told you the album is coming, family. The album is coming. It's coming. I think I took up too many kilobits with the song. Because as soon as I start singing... They start cutting me off because they don't want y'all to get the album. But the album will be released. How Tim does the hits. <clears throat> Yo, so yesterday I go, I get home. I make a couple of calls. I watch some videos. I say I'm going to lay it down for just a, just a second. Then I'm going to get up and I'm going to do this new thing that I got. You know, y'all see it um, when I start cutting up my video for next week. And um, I lay down, and I I don't know what happened. I remember waking back up at ten. I'm uh about about ten thirty eleven o'clock. I said, "Well, I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it. Uh, I'm gonna call it the end of the day for me." So I'm pressing record right now because the gigabits is is dropping. Um, and I want to make sure that I'm able to get y'all the whole show and I see that I'm froze on the screen, but I want to make sure that we're going to be able to get, get y'all everything. So I am recording right now. So if I have to, I will upload the, this part where, uh, the signal drop so that, um, make sure we y'all get the toast and stuff like that. But I woke up and, um, I heard two old white men arguing now <clears throat> sign of the times things are really getting bad when debates are like when your lying cousins come over and you know they start arguing and both of them lying y'all got anybody got family anybody ever have a family situation like that where you had Two individuals arguing about lies. 
and then lying on top of the lies. I ain't even got to see this shit to, to already know. That's what's going on. Goddamn shame. That's the state of the politics of the most powerful country in the world. Where the debate for the seat supposedly of leadership is a comedy show. I'm just saying. That's where it is, family. That's where it is at this point in time. You know what I'm saying? More people are watching it just for the comedy rather than watching it for the substance. We don't even expect substance out of many of our politicians anymore. That's a shame. We expect no substance from them. We expect no truth out of them. And this is a, this is a, a, a acceptable state of existence for us. That shit, that shit, it stinks. It reeks. Um, I went to try to go vote yesterday, and once again the line was super long, so I'm just gonna have to take a whole day, get out there, get in the line, and just walk through. But I will be casting my ballot. Um, and I would advise everybody out there to cast your ballot. You know what I'm saying? Just vote. You know what I'm saying? I, and like I said, if you're going to do down ticket, do a down ticket. If you're going to vote for whoever, vote for whoever. Just vote. You know what I'm saying? Um, no peer pressure. No guilt. You know what I'm saying? But you, if you get an opportunity, get your ass out there and go on. Because we're going to need you voting by 2023. Just letting y'all know. You know what I'm saying? 2023, 2024. We really going to be making some moves and we're going to really, really need you to at least know your way around um, a, a ballot box. Because we uh, we're going to be doing some we're going to be doing some powerful things and we're going to need your help. Now, I'm getting word that GNJ Media will be back up. Uh, I had to make I had to make a well, I still got to make a, a final payment and get things upgraded and we up we moving and we grooving so i will have the lines open so that we can have a discussion we can have a we can do a toast and talk because we kind of started early enough where we're going to be able to do that so let's get into the toast um family feel free if the line drops feel free to call in so that you can listen or go to the uh let's see somebody just dropped a message on me Shouts out to Brother Kwame. He said, make it a superlative. Twitch has spotty connection, but Periscope is working just fine. All right. So, you know, he, we on, we live on Periscope. He found us on Periscope. Um, unfortunately, I don't even know the handle on Periscope. I hope it's Giami something, but more than likely, because sometimes they won't even let you register like that. But anyway, family, we up. We live. It is a pleasure to be here with you. Um, one of the, one of the things that, uh, we definitely want to start talking about is because family, listen, um, here at Giami Journey, we have been perfecting certain things. Um, so anybody out there who has an interest in starting a podcast, you have interest in streaming, you have interest in, in blogging, creating eBooks creating e-courses, we can help you with that, right? We can help you. We can advise you on that. You know what I'm saying? So don't don't be shy. We're going we gonna to start throwing up commercials so that people will know um, what we what we offer and, 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 and at what price point so that you can really make a decision. But I'm just trying to let y'all know that getting on the internet and sharing your expertise is a legitimate way of creating another source or another stream of income in your life. <coughs> and creating these streams is very important, especially during times like this, right? Because something else is coming. And I want to make sure that everybody in Giami Journey is prepared and ready. Right? So we got to start making sure that you know how 
to share your expertise. You know what I'm saying? You are the hero on the journey. Allow G&J Media to advise you, right? Would be that. Because, uh, you know, in every in every story, you have the, the, the uh, you got the hero, you got the villain. And you also have the, the hero has an advisor or somebody that helps them through their journey. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, so, hey, allow us to advise you through your, through your, through your walk. You know what I'm saying? Because it's not hard. None of this stuff is hard. You know what I'm saying? Mistakes happen. Things break. Things fall down. And all you got to do is be patient enough to pick them back up and rebuild them. That's it. That's it. So um, I just wanted to throw that out there. And, of course, today's title was Slept All Evening. Slept All Evening. I got home. I said, man, I, I, I just was extremely, I don't understand. I was extremely tired. I don't understand why, but I was, and it is what it is. I'm not mad, you know, I hope y'all wasn't, so we didn't have a show last night, and I want to remember to do the uh, the quote of the day, since we didn't do one last night. Uh, shouts out, we got two people on Twitch joining us, man, shouts out to whoever is watching us on Twitch, um, so here we go. Let's go on and let's do our toast. I'm going to grab the mango. No pop at all. It's just, you just, it's just so mature. This, this, this batch was so mature. It was just so mature. I don't, I don't understand it. <clears throat> but hey, it is what it is. All right, so first, give an honor to the creator by whatever name you choose to call that creator. We lift up our glass. And we salute that creator. And we say the word of power. We say Ashe. From there, where do we go? Y'all know where we go, family. It's a simple journey. It's a simple. It's not hard. It's an easy walk. Right? So we're going to walk and we're going to cruise right over to our list of our ancestors. Anybody that's new out there that want to add your ancestors to the list, you can put them on the timeline right now in the chat if you want. You could get with us on on our Facebook page, the Giami Journey Media. You know what I'm saying? Inbox us. We'll add your ancestors. Um, or you could go over to gnj.media on the front. Once you sign up, you could go on and leave a message up front. We got you. You building, family. This is a beautiful, beautiful thing. So we lifting up our glass and we salute. We salute. And guess what we say? Y'all know what we say. We say, I say, so let's go to the ancestors. Let me stretch a little bit. Let me scoot over a little bit here. We got Miles Brown, Ms. Ann, Robert, the Texan, the Davis, Herman Brown, Sr., Rosalie, Tilly, George, and William Walter, Chris, Penny, Gas, and Adelina, Alka, Chris, I'm Finn, Cleveland, Geneva, Brown, Margaret, Ellis, Watch, Ellis, Cecil, Ellis, Alvaro, Brown, Gina, Gaines, Herman Brown, Second, Barbara, Twigs, Watch, Ellis, Junior, Katie, Ellis, Nikki, Ellis, Jamon, Jones, Jeremiah, Tapper, John, Fuller, Montague, Pimp, and Nell, No More, Ex, A Pet, My, Rob, Mal Malika Fakur, Dr. Marianne Williams, Kojo Kamara, Elder Farmer, Elder Malik Dixon, Tony Clark, Pastor Youssef, Weston, Elder Ajani, Elder Ron Coleman, Elder Robert Donaldson, Alfred Brofro, Hector Jr., J. Edwards, Carlisle Harris, Grace, Lindy, Inez Harris, William Bill Moss, Phyllis Rose, Sterling, and Lucy Wright. Derek L. Polina, Lux, the brother, Miss Edith Brooks Crawley, Miss Marie Nelson, Mr. Frederick Crawley, Senior, Miss Jerry Brunson, Mr. Lonzo Johnson, Miss Marie McDowell, Janice Foster, Charles Jordan, Kel Smith, Walter Smith, Richard Trigg, Francis Johnson, Mary Franklin, Jimmy Williams, Daniel Ford, George Gibson, Nana Loretta Clark, Inez McCray, Fritz Clark, Frankie Justice, Katie Justice, Derek Renneman, Virginia Rogers, Reverend Jane Smith, Lewis Henderson, Kevin Spratling, Mary Elizabeth Walker, Raymond Walker Sr., Sarah Jane Carter, Michael Ford Jr., Kelly D. Russell, Susie B. Smith, Teresa Clay, Mel Mildar Hodge, Mel Mildar Hodge Jr., Herman Copeland, Mitchell Copeland, Jenny Clay, Bird, B.D. Sale, Will Levita Farmer, I go, so Sue, Shell, Harvey, I Sharp, Maine, I Evelyn Theodos Hasbury, Harvey Hasbury Sr., Leonard Dickinson, T.C. Islam, Terrell Dunbar, Wolf, Thomas Sarah Barry, Mark Walsh, Merle B. Thornton, Pearl G. Thornton, Nadia Johnson, Florence M. Carter, Joanne Thornton, Edgar Tricia Lewis, Juanita Wright, Robert Wright, George Wright, Mary Eliza Frederick Davis, Mary Elizabeth Rogers, Mary Esther Keechita Reese, Linda Watson, Hammonds, Jarrell Giles Watson, Sparrow, Slimmy Seven, Lewis, Andrew Holmes, Percy Moore, Mildred Owens, Booker T. Bowden, Charlie Hunt, Sammy Stover, Heater Pearson, Sturgeon Thornton, Richard Thornton, Lavina Hall, Freeman Bankster, Mary Moss, Sophia Peacock, Willie Thornton, Napoleon Kidney, Mark Ramsey, Paul Ramsey, Matt Ramsey, David Ramsey, Charles E. Thornton, Frankie Quails, Urania Thornton, Bernice Quails, Ernestine Jackson, Frankie Johnson, Teresa Mormon, Leon Johnson, James W. West Sr., James Parham, Dana Jones, 
Jones, Henry J Henry Worlds, James Farmer, Mary Chavez, Leon Grace, Bessie Johnson, Hadley Lovester, Mary Morland, Paul Morland, Dota Caleb, Rosemary Marchinera, Diamond Ted Wellman, Fred Douglas, Triggs the second, Vina Triggs, Reverend Eddie Moore, Helen Fuller, Eugene Jackson Sr., Richard Ellis, Silas Alexander, Charles Maxwell, Percy Mary Alexander, Arthur Reynolds, Arthur Reynolds, Stanley Lockhart, William Lockhart, William Lockhart. Oh, man. Um, oh, man. Lost it. All right, let's go. Without any further ado, uh, the Lockharts. Uh, uh, Stanley Lockhart, Ricky Lockhart, William Lockhart. Woodrow Lockhart, Brenda Porter, Deacon Hargrove, Carla Sawyer, Andrew Parker, Doris Donald, Ellis Murphy, D'Amico Russell, Dylan Monaries, Gina Ruth Jones, Jaina Callahan. First page. Then we move to uh, um, uh, William Walter West, Nigel Perez, Elder Basiji Filani, Jim Robinson, Gladys Johnson, Valerie Clark, John and Mary Sullivan, Dirk Johnson, Antonio Johnson, Delise Waters, Defridus Hines, Anna Bostic, Anna Bostic, Winifred Scannabay, Wilson Haley, Emma Hines, Phyllis Lee, Eugene Spradley, Kevin Spradley, Charles Wooden, Pitty Brown, Roy Lee, Prince Up Jr., Miriam Johnson, Wilbur Longmire, Ida Candy, Janice Carter, Michael Carter, Leon Pina Carter, Mark Carter, William Carter, Lisa Jordan, Charles Lee Mosley, Dorothy R. Blair, Ransom Evans Sr., Sam Evans Sr., Nalon Blair Sr., Edward Stevens, Sue Ann Stevens, Joe Davis, Timothy Butler, Gene Holmes, Dana Jones, Peter Charles, Christy Nichols, Cardinal Robinson, Rosemary Charles, Ada Pearl, Bob Ingles, Jack Wallace, Warren M. Finch, Warren P. Finch. Tim Ingalls, Audrey Finch, William Billingsley Jr., Jennifer Sensabaugh, Hazel Gasson, Jerry Brantley, Brian Watson Jr., Kaniko Parsons, Jason Cathy, Bradford, Thomas Bradley, um, also known as Uncle Buki, also known as Gypsy, Reverend Roosevelt Word, the first Stacey Trice, Frank Smith, Mother Bertha, Michael Leonard, David Brown, Ruth Carter, June Cox, Ruth Cox, Paula Cox, Ronald Irvin, Judy Hubbard, Irene Johnson, Francis Booth Jefferson, Dan Wilkerson, C.M., and McClendon, Jerry Doyle, Mina Robinson, Mary Nichols, <coughs> excuse me, Patricia Williams, Shabaka Ture, Greg G. Two Gibson, Donna Hill, Richard Glebus, Lee Irby, Tommy Irby, Boy Irby, Jim Gosha, George and Halley Johnson, Archie and Margarita Armstead, Diane Scott, Erica Armstrong, Claire Fox, Gene Evans, Archie Beck, Anna McGill, Charles McDaniel, Christine Cottrell, Aunt Becca, Alice Arnold, Arthur Arnold, Hattie Reed, Charles Reed, Euler and Andrew Baker, Patricia and Edwin Brooks, Gwendolyn and Bob Hatch, Kimball Vernon, Bradley Kim, Janie Hare, Tom McKay, Spencer Sturgis, Sally Mae Baker, Ethel Baker, Creola Baker, Geneva Baker, Aaron Nino, Baby Hatch, Hatch Senior, Mally Miller, Housie Hatch, Dad Cleveland, Mother Gibson, Ags Nixon, John Bowie, Lester and Rachel Saunders, Doretha Ross, Riola Ross, Robert Nelson, Francis Stevenson, Leroy Stokes, Neely Johnson, Fletcher Swan, Maddie and Charlie Scott, Ida Casey, Thomas Cooper, Vivian Stevenson, Mona Ann Lewis, Cornetta Lyman Lewis, John Jackson, William Dallas Lewis, Mary Francis, Chappelle Jackson, Michael Slade, Joanne Perkins, Richard Jackson, Martha Ford Dawson, Big Mama, Nanny Harris, Eva Ford, James Harrison, Margaret Towns, Mary Williams, Leroy Q. Heath Sr., Albert Moore, Miss Vanilla, Albert Motley, Geraldine Elizabeth, Douglas Thompson, Ernst Houston, Lud Alls, Elijah Alls, Jerome Alls, and West Staten, Joe Jamel Alls, and Pierce, Donald Carter, Lily Green, Nathan Green, Bad Vaughn, John Dewey, Ruth Beer, Tim Butler, Raymond Laura Newton, J.B. Foggy, Thomas Noon Sr., Baba Naeem, Jeanette Sanders, J.C. Sanders, Roy Pruitt, H.J. Brantley Sr., Henry Wilson, Rufus Jenkins, Minnie Wilson, Catherine Sanders, Muriel Ellis, Elizabeth Sanders, Henrietta Irby, Mildred Armstead, Margaret Armstead, Catherine Anthony, Ruby Brown, Charles Walker Sr., Charlie Walker, Cecil Russell, Diane Irvin, Harun Phillips, William Ford, Margaret Logan, Phyllis Barnett, Lee Irvin Sr., Michael Irvin, Ozella Watson, Hugo Watson, John Caldwell Sr., Robert Lee Caldwell, Nevaeh Mitchell, Ron McCormick Sr., Sabrina Easley, Rashawn Easley, Javier McCormick, Barbara Ann Reed, Dorothy Ann Reed, John Reed, Shekamaha Reed Jr., John Reed Jr., Patricia Reed, Edward R. Benson Sr., Ethel H. McNair, Lois Fernandez, Jacqueline Broaddus, Reginald Alvin, Masbury Cooper, George Swan, and my name Grayson, Charles Scott, Charles H. Scott, Michael Morgan, Charlene Morgan, Sybil Evans, McNabb, Annie Ferguson, William Ferguson, Shelby McClendon. And now, we move to the Black Book. We are on Joella Giles, James Carswell, Liberta Adams, also known as Aunt Sis. Elder Shaka McNair, Anthony Brown, Jonathan Poor, Lottie Gaucher, Cousin Tony, Michael Johnson, James Jimmy Johnson, Barbara Shane Lewis, Ronald Shelf Jr., Jamie Top, Westina Banks. We got Joseph Bingham, Quincy, Mama, Aunt Lady, Abraham Isaac Cundiff, Aunt Barbara Lewis, Renee Johnson, Joy, Ryan Ross Riggins, Dermonte, Marcus Price, Ness Words, Marshawn McHale, Demetrius Beard, Herb Jefferson, Ralph Mickens, Eric Walker, Quasi Sample, Candace Simmons, Severin Clayton, Leonard Jones, Sade Garner, Melvin Scott Sr., Eric Clarence Lumpkin, Elizabeth Johnson, Mr. Thornton, Jashandra Lynette Lewis, Henderson Mosley, Charles Jordan, Henry S. II, Fanny L. Webb, Dan Walton, Al T. Sue Walton, Emma Walton, James Randolph Dowles, Sonny, Pete Walton, William Walton, Fred Powers. We have Elijah Juan Hakeem and Como, 
We got Alberta T. Davis. We got Charles Davis, Willie R. Mackey. Also known as Dr. Cream Mackey, Victor Bowden, Tracilla Kitty Virgin, Lucy White, Robbie Lee White, Emma Jean White, Talton Roger White, R.L. White, Jesse White, Ruby Jewel White, Johnson Carl White, Desi Woods, Tillar Woods, Lennox, Jim Woods, Lizzie Woods, Juanita Alexander Brown, Cynthia Ann Wright, Richard Dorsey, Andy Simpson, Jamara Simpson, Regina Hopkins, Joseph Simpson, Nettie Dorsey, Eleanor Hopkins, Edward Webster, Alice Webster, Ivy Webster, Arnella Willis, Ethel Lane, Samantha DeMond, Ethel Marshall, Steve, Dougie Shelton, we have... William Bill Walker, Carl Rico Johnson, Kim Gray, Stuart A. Johnson, Edward Young III, Isaac Jackson Sr., Drusilla Morrill, Wayne Young, Christina Young, Thomas Young, Frank Merrill, Sylvester Foster, James and Lizzie Winston, Abe and Julia Lawrence. We got Ozell Leathers Sr., Gladys Copa, Ozell Leathers Jr. We got Geneva Jackson. We got R.J. Lacey, also known as Tooth to Don. We got Sarah Winston, Chris Kenny, Margaret Mentor. We got Mary Smith, Juanette, Florine Stith Gibbs. Carl William Duncan Jr., Janet Callahan, Danny Hill, Miko D. Nice Hill, Andre Martin, Mabel Williams, Terry Brown, Teresa Biddle, Levana Kincaid, Carla Sawyer, Reverend Jesse Porter, Deacon Ezekiel Dennis, Brenda Porter, Craig Lee Jones, Granny Bueller, Papa Al Riesland, Inez Smith, George Gamble Sr., Joseph Gill, Lashonda Jamar, Leroy Riley, Mona, Yolanda Hunter, Yvonne Patrice Turner, Herman Reeves, Amanda Reeves, Josh Reeves, Lena Kate, Herman Reeves, Pam Johnson, Vera, and Reese Fisher, Jerry Johnson McCallum, also known as Mama Moon. We got Sheila Ann Lee. We got Panchita Alba. We have Donald Brooks, Barbara Moses, Ida Spate, Ira Branson, Eric Winston, Nation Builder Dan Bridges, Francisco Matisse, also known as Sonny. We have Charles Stevens Jr., King Pleasant, Sarah Keat, Lena Shepard, Mabel Haskins, Bardell Woodland, Mabel Haskins, Wilbur Shepard, Dennis Jackson, William Haskins, Geraldine Jackson, Henry Jackson Sr., Edward Jones, Leslie Travis, and Charlize Barnes. Family, we have done it again. We have made it through another toast. And we raise up our glass and we salute those ancestors and we say, in power, I say. We also can say, the word of power, yeah. So it looked like it's going through, so I'm going to stop the recording just for a second. Well, yeah, it just dropped, so I'm going to leave it on. All right. So uh, now, from our ancestors, which we lift our glass up for, once again, we say our shade. From there, family, we move to the present moment right now we are in Nia we are on Nia I want to give all of the Nia babies a round of applause hopefully the crowd is still here uh oh Simba you yelling out it okay hold on the whole crew is back so I want to remind you are standing in the congregation of the mighty the home of the stubborn minority, the place where your hustle builds muscle. This is Giami Journey Media. Of course, you know this is the heart of a simple production, and I am your host, Brother Hot Tim. And you know we strive, strive, strive to blow up your old paradise. So moving into the moment, family, we already gave the Nia babies a round of applause. But for those that don't understand and we sit around wondering, what is he talking about, Nia babies? What does he mean? I mean that we have taken major steps in our personal lives and decided that we were going to take back our time. What do you mean, Brother Hot Tim? We took back the day. We took back the days. And we named them culturally so that they could constantly remind us. They could be echoes in us. They could be um, tools of communication between us so that we could constantly remind ourselves and plug ourselves back into our culture. As I constantly stress, family, our culture is supposed to protect us. Our culture is supposed to remind us and move us to do better for ourselves because we are not only responsible for ourselves, we're responsible 
for others in our culture, those that have passed, those that are here now, and those that are in the future, which is all in a strange, some type of scientific, science fiction way, happening all at the same time. Kind of dope, but kind of scary, right? Kind of dope, but kind of scary. But the PC is, we are taking back our moments. We're taking back our time. And in taking back our time, it means that with that little bit of time we're taking back, we have control of that space. What's the importance of controlling the space? Once again, space provides opportunities. Whether there's resources on the space or whatever, we have to use our geniusness, as Dr. Kelsey would say, and be able to create new things up out of it. Space provides you with the resources so that you can actually get your economy working. And that's what we're working on here at Giami Journey. Constantly, constantly trying to get the space and the time so that we can get people working on moving us to the next level. Because we've been, we, we've, been, we've been going in a circle. And it's not a bad circle, family. Because I don't want to take anything from any of our ancestors in the past. They did what they knew how to do with what they had. We got totally different tools. Now it's time for us to move to the next level. It's time for us to get on what the day is. It's time for us to get on purpose. Many of us have been living our lives on accident. Many of us have been doing movements by accident. Many of us have been taking actions by accident. Now it's time for us to get on near. So in this moment right now, right, in this moment right now, as I do every day, I want to ask you to activate the reticular formation. I want you to start looking for purpose going on around you. Look for Nia popping off around you. And those that want to know a little bit more in depth of what I'm talking about and what we did in Giami Journey, by all means, take action and go to the e-course. You know what I'm saying? Get the e-course. Go pick it up. You know what I'm saying? Just It's seven days. You can look at it when you want to. You can get it now and look at it three years from now. It makes no difference. It's a fee e-course. And why it's there, I want to make sure that you take advantage of it. Join us on the journey. Hell, do your own journey. If you need some advice, give us a call. Right? Let's get the building. So now, family, we are on Nia. For those that don't speak the language, Nia means purpose. Nia means purpose. Right? So we lift up our glass to this present moment and the power in this moment. And we pledge that we're going to use this moment. Because when we start wasting our moments, we're not getting, we're not wasting our time. We're wasting our children's time. And that's not fair. The babies deserve some time. The babies deserve space. And when we sit around fucking around, playing games, we giving up their space and their time. Because people are trying to encroach on our space and time. You saw it in the debates, probably where they didn't even mention us. Maybe they did. I wouldn't watch it. Well, they didn't even mention us. You know what I'm saying? Were well, they playing games? Divide and conquer still. You know what I'm saying? All of, I mean, it's just getting, it's getting ridiculous. It's getting stupid. And we keep, I ain't going to say we keep falling for the shit, but now... It's, get, it's to a point where it's almost funny that they honestly think that they're going to keep on running the same tricks. And all of us are supposed to just, <gasps> look that way. All of us ain't on that shit. So in this moment, we raise up our glass to our power. And we're going to use this moment to build. And we say, I say, from their family. We move to the future generation. We toast our children, our children's children, on to infinity. We choose. The, we toast the ones that are here, and we and we toast the ones that aren't here, and we go all the way to infinity. If we handle our business in the moment, we teach our children to handle their business in the moment. We will always be here. But when we slack up on that generational communication, <laughs> when we stop passing the culture, because the culture was what protects you, family. Right? I know what I wanted to talk about today. Freedom. Speaking of the children, freedom is like a garden. Freedom is like a garden. You have to go out into nature and you have to carve out your space. You have to put up borders around that space. You have to organize 
what you have in there so that you can find what you want. And because some things grow better by each other. So you got to know what's going on within your small garden. And you always have to be on the watch out for people or things coming from the outside to try to take over your garden. It's a constant and never ending struggle when you have a garden. Even in the wintertime when you can't grow nothing, you got to make sure that you are, you got the things laid out so that your garden, the soil can be better in the next year. It's a never ending struggle. And we got to realize that we got to train our children on that, right? So we lift up our glass to our future generations and we say, Ashe. From there, family, where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? I'm going to stop that one right there because I am going I am going to cut that last part out. Freedom is like a garden. I like that shit. Right? But anyway, I shouldn't have stopped it because the stream is stopping. Oh, but okay, it's cool. But anyway, family, from our children, we move to um, um, all of our relations and we lift up our glass and we say, I say from all of our relations, y'all know where we go. We go to that selfish toast. What is it that you need right now in this moment to improve your life, to move you towards where you're going and i ain't talking about and i want to be clear on this part i'm not talking about no materialistic shit i'm talking about what are the tools that you need to move towards the greater you just for you i say from there family we move on and we toast our tribe my tribe is yami what's your tribe what's your accountability network lift up our glass and we say i say Last but not least, family, I want to toast the most magnificent, the most marvelous, the most beautiful, uplifting, inspiring person in the room right now. I'm lifting my glass up to you. I toast you. And we say, I say, I say, I say. Family, I wish you peace, power, joy, and 100 years. Ooh, that mango strong. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I know where we're going to go. We're going to do this first. All right. Then we're going to get the scene ready. <sighs> we got a little bit of news that we can cover today. Lines are open. 614-556-4535. Black line is open. The black line is open. 614-556-4535. Right? <laughs> but anyway, make sure, like I said, if you have something that you want to discuss, we got a couple of minutes so that we can sit down and we can wrap the tapes. You know what I'm saying? Do a little debate if you want or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I have some discussion. You know what I'm saying? What do you think about freedom? Being a guard. Is it a good metaphor? You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, a good uh, some a good symbol. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what do you, I mean, what did you think about the debates last night? Feel free, 614-556-4535. Let me make sure that the line is up. I am going to make a, a nice transition real quick, and we're going to move straight over. Well, look like the lines are open. I want to make sure they're using the right equipment on my device. Yes, they are. Okay, everything is cool. Our lines are open. All right, family. Remember, we are still working on it. It'll be up soon. I just got a message this morning. And maybe later on in the day, this thing might be popping off for the weekend so that we can do some experiments with it. But know that Kwanzaa season is coming. And this mug is going to be broadcast in Kwanzaa's from all over Ohio. I wish I could say the whole Midwest, but you know, baby steps, baby steps, you know, but hell, if somebody from somewhere else, if you want to stream your Kwanzaa, there's a possibility that, you know, it'll hold up. I'm, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. All right. So, um, but once again, in order to become part of the tribe, all you got to do is click tribe. Right? And well it won't take you there, but it'll take you to sign in. So let's let's let, let me walk you through it. Let me sign out first. Boom. Alright, and let's go on back. I'm gonna just click out right here. We're gonna go right here. 
You go to gnj.media. And it bring you right over there, right? So you're gonna have to sign in before you can do anything. You can't, you can't, and you, 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 um, you can't. You might be able to see the screen if the if it was something playing behind here, but you can't have, you can't comment or discuss or anything unless you sign in. You sign in or you sign up. Boom, sign in. All right, cool. There we go. Y'all see? Y'all see the screen behind it pop up? All right, so now to get, now this screen right here is just a message screen, and this is for a anybody. You know what I'm saying? Once you sign in, this is for anybody. So you're going to leave a message here. Boom, boom, boom. You see, boom. Oh, wow, wow. Uh, I just say deep thought. My fault. African deep thought. African Deep Thought dot com. And speaking of African Deep Thought dot com, but then also you get in, you can open up your page. You can open up a page for your group. Um, you can upload videos, and there's other things that come with it as well. Especially if you are a G and J, um, a G, uh, you go if you are a supporter, you supporter, you get access, full access. To what we are able to do on the site. Other than that, you still got some, you know, you can upload videos and stuff like that and have have your own page where you can share stuff and still be able to chat and do a lot of stuff like that. Um, but anyway, uh from there, you also y'all know y'all go to the shop, as y'all see. I got on some of the Giami gear. I think this one got the thing on the back. Let's see. Can you see? I'm just I ain't gonna stand up, but you know. Anyway, but tribe up. There you go. There go all. There go the goods right there. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Show more. We go to show more. Let's go a little bit deeper. Let's go down the rabbit hole. See what y'all got on Giami Journey Media, man. Y'all got anything I like? All right, I like. Okay, once again, we got the baby clothes. We got the baby clothes. Right. Got lady shirts. Got men's shirts. We got book bags. We got. Got all the goods. We got cups. We got all types of stuff. So, you know, come check us out. Let's do some business. Let's do some business. Let's build, family. We got face masks. I got to get one of those. I got to get one. Uh, I ordered one, but they said, I got, I guess I pushed the kids or the children's one. And I ain't want the children's one. I'm just being honest. I didn't want the children's one. So now my girl is fighting over who could wear the daily toaster mask i also got the uh i also got their uh sweatshirts so they they ran around with their little sweatshirts now they wanted them they saw that i had made them and you know they're like uh cleve was cleve cleve is cool he don't he don't even care about that type of stuff all right so let's look at our stock price um so they say we have 241 in the last 28 days 241 percent Post engagements up 52% for the last 28 days. Okay, 3,265. That's real good. Um, 19 likes. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. And that, like I said, all that is possible only because of you. But let's, just like the stock market, let's watch how it change when we do a micro look. We're going to go in up. We only reached 990 people this week. Down 91%. Damn, so we usually reach over 1,000 people every week? Is that what they saying? Post engagements down. 29%, and we did 771 page likes, but we got seven page likes in the last seven days between October 16th and October 22nd. Family, y'all showing out. I am, I, I am. So let's see what happened yesterday. Yesterday, they said we only had 236 people reached. That's down 46%. Post engagement. Only 98 people, just yesterday, just 98 people. That's it. This is all they said. You know, just 98 people. For, but for the content we put out here, shit. Page likes, we ain't get, we got zero yesterday. So it's down 100%, they say. Man, uh, I take that. All right, I got pinned to the top. I got Blunt Talk. If you haven't had an opportunity to check out the Blunt Talk, say Blunt Talk reached 302 people. Um... Uh, 250 engagements 
Oh, they give me an option to boost. We, I think we're going to boost it. We got 11 shares, 72 comments. Go ahead. Go ahead, Sister Navita. Somebody put up a sad face. Who put up the sad face? Who sad? Who that sad? Oh, Gianni Journey Me. Okay, cool. Shots out. Here we go. Hold on. Um, of course, Gianni Journey Mia, Navita Nelson, Tasha Reynolds, L. Op Solom, S. Freedom Johnson, J. Webb, Conjure Candy, Richard Dion Miller, Lisa Austin, Janisha Ross, Lisa Bra- um, Brookins. Who else? And we got Pamela Swan. Thank you for the likes. Um, and thank you even for the sad. Now, I want to apologize because I do not know what happened with the sound for the caller. So I'm going to have to do some research. Like I said, this journey is not complicated. It's just like little small things that might work one week. and Just like just like with our show today, right? Just like with our show today. Yesterday, the my hard drive wasn't, wasn't working right. So what I decided to do was to allow it to warm up. I like you know, I mean some of y'all old enough to remember where in when it was bitter cold if you grew up in Ohio and you was old enough, you was the one selected to go out and start the car. So uh some of these some of these electronics you gotta do them just like an old car. You gotta let that shit warm up. I'm sitting up here, this shit's bugging me out. Because at first when I started playing it this morning it was doing the same thing. So I said, Let me let it play. So I let it play for about three minutes. She was smooth as hell. I said, oh, my God. Is that all it took? All right, cool. But I still got to make the transfer. I'm still making the transfer. You got to repeat. You got to repeat for a little while longer, computer. Well, anyway, so um, so I am going to I'm going to work on uh, the sound so that y'all can um, get. The full call, Sister Navita already said she's going to have some of the people who was trying to call in to call back in to explain the story because they really couldn't hear it. it was very, very low when I went back to do the um, re-listen. Um, scientists found a new way to break down the most common plastics. Now, I like to, I, I'm, I'm eclectic in what I do. I, I chose this article, um, and I just want y'all to know that like I said, there are all types of different industries that are popping up that we can not only get ourselves into, but we can also start pushing our young people into. So they have a new way to break break down plastic. Now plastic plastic sits around for a very long time, and they have been looking for ways to get rid of chocolate. I mean, my fault. Well, chocolate being us for a long time, but they found something. That can break down plastic. And I want to see what this is real quick. The petrochemical industry produces more than 88 million tons of polythylene. Making it the most common plastic in the world. Scientists have found a new way to upcycle it. According to a study published in Science on Thursday. It could help deal with growing plastic pollution crisis. Polythylene comes in several different forms and is used in everything from plastic bags and food packages to electrical insulation and industrial piping. Since it's so common and our our recycle system is so broken, we end up throwing away a shitload of the stuff. Oh, my type of writer. It can end up in landfills or the ocean where it breaks down very slowly or get burnt up in waste incinerators that emit toxic chemicals. But in a new study, the authors found a way to speed up the process of breaking down polythylene and turn it into alkyl, okay, alkyromic, alkyromatic molecules, which are used as suffragants in cosmetics and laundry detergent, lubricants for machinery, and refrigeration fluids. Oh. Globally is a nine bit. Listen, globally is a nine billion dollar market. So what is this method, right? Is it something that we could give our one of our young people some some shit in their garage and figure out? Because a lot of this stuff, you will really be surprised where they get hints, clues, and even a whole solution from individuals 
who just have a passion for something. And it's very important that we, like for example, in our community, how many chemists do we have? Or people that just play with chemistry. You know what I'm saying? That would be an excellent e-course. That would be an excellent um, um, uh, e-book. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of our a lot of our people got um, hobbies or have worked in fields, but they don't. They're not very vocal about that. And and I I get kind of upset about it because like you are in many ways the perfect model for many of our young people, right? Somebody who did something so different. I didn't. I wouldn't even think that you did it, right? And we need to share this information because what it does is not only see because people say, well, if 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 we see people in these positions that look like us and make it make us believe that it's possible. So what happens when you see somebody from a collective of people that your family is involved with doing something? Does that not make it a little bit more approachable for you? Right? All right, but anyway. This isn't the first time scientists have figured out how to break down poly, polythylene. There are other mes- methods of chemical recycling the material, but conventional methods of breaking the plastic down require heating it up to a temperature between 983 and 1,832 degrees Fahrenheit, 500 to 100 degrees Celsius, and using solvents or added hydrogen to speed up the process. By contrast, the author's new method only requires heating it up to around 570 degrees Fahrenheit, 300 degrees Celsius, and use no solvents or added hydrogen, instead relying on only a comparatively gentle catalyst of platinum with aluminum oxide. He just gave us the goddamn recipe. Just gave us the recipe. Right? I'm just saying. Just gave us the recipe. All this free plastic and all this lubrication, so much lubrication that could be made. Lubrication come in handy in so many different ways. Right? I'm just saying. Just saying. I don't know what they, I'm just saying. I'm going to shut my mouth because I'm about to get nasty. But I'm just, so I'm very interested in, 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 in things that we can expose our young people to. That they might have a passion for. Like, you know, I'm just, because I got to, with Cleve, I got to just, I'm just trying to wait to see what it is that he, you know what I'm saying? Because it's like, because you know they got it, you know it's theirs when they, like a pit bull. You know what I'm saying? Now, now there's other things, and there's some things that our children lock on to, like a pit bull, uh, that we got to kind of be concerned about. But this is the issue for me. Can this, what you love, make you useful to our culture? And that that goes for all of us. Does our skills, does our skill set make us useful for the culture? Can I transfer my skills within my culture? Not only making us better, but making everybody else, uh, everybody else around us better. Making us better competitors. Making us, um, making our lifestyles better. Making our political situation better. Making our educational situation better. Hell, family, I mean, if you don't realize that a lot of this stuff may never go back to the way that it was. Right? Some of y'all have true homeschooling skills. Just simple things that you could pass on to some of these parents right now. You know what I'm saying? Because some of y'all, some of y'all homeschooled and had a job and was able to do it and make sure you was able and it was certain practices that you put in place. That's an ebook. We got to start passing on this knowledge. Cause we talk about we talk about the H of Kim mites. But the ancient Kimites used to keep shit on scrolls as well as write it in the rock. Where is, where is, 
where is where we're sharing our stuff. We have this internet. Let's etch it into this internet. Because you never know who needs the information that you have. Like, I need I, I need some backup singers for uh, my album. It's coming. I told y'all it's coming. Y'all don't believe me. It's coming. How Tim does the hits. Getting the studio warmed up right now. Right? Getting some of the other producers, because I've been being approached by these other, I only want certain producers to work on my shit. Just letting you know. And the, the one of the key songs we're going to do, because I'm having to fight to try to get the Mr. Rogers theme song. I want to I wanna start the album off with that. It's a beautiful day. I just don't know what style I'm going to do it. You understand? But, I, you know, I need backup singers. Some of y'all was backup singers for people, and you might be in a writing e-book or something about being a backup singer. And share it. You never know. How about to play the tambourine? I need a tambourine player. One with the quick wrist. I don't know if y'all, those, those that used to go to church, y'all know what I'm talking about. Or go to church now. Y'all might got, because some people play them damn tambourines. I just be like, God damn. All right. You need to be in a band. You ever, you ever seen a tambourine player and be like, man, you, you, I think you could make a living doing that shit. You, you good. <laughs> Why knowledge entrepreneurship is taking off. Let's go in here. This is entrepreneurship.com. Uh, my fault. I didn't get credit for the last article we read. My fault. Let me go back. This is from earther.gizmodo, gizmodo.com. And the author's name was Darna Noor. Y'all got it? All right, so let's go back. Why knowledge, what is knowledge entrepreneurship? Hmm, I was interested. By Greg Smith, entrepreneur, leadership, network writer. If this year has taught us anything, it's how quickly things can change. As much as we've seen the way we live and work up in it over the last six months, we also have seen new opportunities emerge, especially in the realm of entrepreneurship. One of the promising areas for those looking to start a business is sharing and selling skills and knowledge online. Where in the hell has brother? I, I, I was I was ahead of the curve. Brother Shock was ahead of the curve. Sharing and selling skills and knowledge online. Hold on. In early 2019, the online course market was for, uh, forecast to be worth $300 billion by 20. I have to, I, I, I got to say this article. In early 2019, the online course market was forecast to be worth $300 billion by 2025. I've been trying to put some of y'all into this market for the last two years, possibly. And they say within the next four, because we almost done with this year. This, this, this shit, 2020 is a wrap. Within the next five years, if we survive COVID. But even with COVID, though, I want y'all to think about that. The value is going up. $300 billion. So how much is it worth now? But I'm, and the coronavirus has only accelerated. Oh, I swear I didn't read this. Only accelerated that time law, timeline, layoffs, furloughs, and change of work structure have um, prompted more people than ever to take their careers into their own hands. Increasingly, many are realizing the promise and profits in building a business based on their most valuable assets, the skill and knowledge they already possess. We can help you build it right here. We can help you. Look, they got Entrepreneur Inside member only content. Subscribe now. Just five dollars. See? 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 
We've been talking about, we ahead of the curve. I'm just trying to let y'all know, family. And some people that's taking me serious and all those, I'm going to give you 100%. Those that's, that's taking it serious, I'm going to give you 100%. As a matter of fact, Elder Daryl, I have to go on because I gave him a head start. So now I'm going to go and start advertising because he got he did one of the first e-courses with me, right? So <laughs> shots out. Shots out. Let's give him a round of applause. Give him a round of applause. Where y'all at? There you go. All these skills, they call it, right? What they call it? Knowledge entrepreneurship. Taking what you know and you're sharing it with the world. Can't be, there's no, there's no easier thing to do. Uh, It's official. Solar is the cheapest electricity in history. There are pl- there's plenty of ways that we could make a come up off solar energy as well. Family. There's plenty of ways. I mean, like I said, I mean, some of the stuff we should have been doing in some form of fashion, but and I know we got I know we got individuals in our community that might have indirect knowledge on how to work with um solar energy in some form of fashion. I know we do. I know we do because I I, I, I I be running into people and, and like I said, you just look at them, you be like, you're just an elder. I mean, I'm like, so I'm, a, I'm, all, I'm all the way out of that just an elder shit because what I'm seeing is we got some geniuses and they just sitting on it. It's like, you could do what? You, you used to do what? Oh, dog. Come on. Come on. You got to share some of that. You understand what I'm saying? But anyway, but now, and what this means is that, for example, solar roofs. Some of our, some of some of our um, sons, nephews, and daughters, and nieces, and that might not be good um, necessarily doing some of the stuff in school, but got the actual uh, uh, physical skills and being able to handle hammers and being able to handle uh, tools. Um, and could lift some of this shit up, could start putting people's solar roofs on because that's what's about to happen. That's what's about to happen, right? And also, we might need to come up with something that, you know, during the wintertime here that we could put up over the solar cells to kind of protect them during the wintertime. So that means that somebody had to come out and install this as well. How do we cover it up without making our roofs look ugly? And making it affordable. Right? We might have to have like a do-rag for for the roof during the winter time. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm quite sure we have the abilities to come up with some stuff like that. But you know, because you know, for me, like I said, we, are, we, we got a deal with what's present. This, what's coming up in these elections. Are, are very important, but we never need to lose the fact that we have to go on and start fighting for our space and time because the, this is the issue. I'm a big proponent of reparations, as many as y'all, as many as many of you know, but I I don't believe in sitting around and waiting for motherfuckers to give me shit. I'm gonna let you know the debt is there. I'm gonna keep talking about the debt every time we sit down and we eat dinner, nigga. You got my money? No, no, no. okay, motherfucker. You got my money? No, what money? No, don't, don't, don't do, don't do that. Don't do that. We trying to have some peace here. Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. All right, cool. So we talked about the debt. All right, cool. And and we need to keep the debt up in their face. But I ain't waiting for nobody to do shit for me or mine. I'm getting out. And I'm doing it, and I'm trying to create little niches for us, trying to create niches for you, or at least help you create your niche for yourself. Get out here and do it. And we practice this ujima and start growing. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Nothing wrong with it. You know? So, um, but yo, let me see what else did I post up. I think that's it. Okay. A key quote from Ebro in the morning interview with Ice Cube. Um, 
Let's go on through that real quick, and then we I'm going to get up out of here. Sasha and Gina! Real life at Gianni Journey. All right, so we ain't got to read all of this. But I just want y'all to hear some of these quotes. Below, below are five things learned from the conversation. Working with the Trump administration to help black Americans. Hold on. Um, this is Ice Cube saying, We were contacted by the Trump campaign. Trump Trump campaign because they said they love our plan and wanted to talk to us about our plan. He said, so once we talked to them about our plan, what we had and what we were envisioning and also making sure money went ex exactly where it was so supposed to go, the upgrading their plan, I didn't come out of there. It was not a photo op situation. No, look what I did. Look what I did. Actually, I told them nobody's going to believe you unless you do something. So they just called him basically as a consultant. And, you know, and, and please, fam, before we jump to conclusions about anybody, especially with us dealing with them, we always have to, in a sense, try to get behind the scenes. Or not even try to get behind, try to get more information. Before you start running around talking about ice cube. He done broke my heart. And, 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 and I got a question. If Ice Cube did vote Republican and voted for Donald Trump, what the fuck that got to do with you and your heart? I, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I, I'm going I'm to quote, quote one of the young men that I, I had a pleasure of, of running with every now and then. He said, it's a damn shame when we hold rappers more accountable for their politics than we hold our politicians. Shame on y'all talking about I, my heart broke because I do help Trump crying and shit. Get out of here with that shit. He presented a plan, which is something that some of these motherfucking talking heads should be doing. Some of these people with thousands and thousands of followers should be doing. Some of the, you know what I'm saying? Ice Cube is doing something that needs to be done. On addressing Eric Trump after tweeting a photo of a Photoshop image of himself and 50 Cent both wearing Trump 2020 caps. So y'all know that was Photoshopped. I ain't even gonna read that shit. On comments that Donald Trump drives, promotes white supremacy through um through words and actions. White supremacy does not turn me off, he said, but it's everywhere. And it's on both sides of the aisle. Please, somebody prove them wrong. Some of y'all just be like, well, they, they're a nicer type of white supremacy. You know, they, 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 they put rubber on the bottom of their heels before they kick us. Fuck out of here. Um, both sides of the aisle. That's just the reality that we live in. And I'm not naive to that. We're engulfing. We're engulfed. For those that don't uh, know. Engulf means surround, totally submerged. It's everywhere. Engulfed in white supremacy. That's just something we have to fight our way out of, man. We're going to have to fight on all fronts. On Pearson's decision to tweet about their meeting. Don't need to read that. We already know because it's like soon as you have a meeting and you have a name, politicians are going to use that. This is Democrats, this is Republicans, this is independents. That's politics. So we don't even need that. Who will he vote for in election? I'm going to skip that one because that's not my business nor your business. It's your vote, Ice Cube. Do what the fuck you want with it, my friend. You know what I'm saying? Now, as a culture, we have a certain responsibility. But I have to trust that he's going to do what he feels is best for us. Period. Now. I don't even have to feel that about him. I have to go out. And you have to go out. And you have to lay your vote down for what's best for us. By what you believe and what you know. All right? I'm working with the Democrats to implement his plan. Now, here we go. They said they liked the plan. That they would deal with it after the election. They selling that, they selling that whole food. I told y'all about that yesterday. That's that whole. We're going to talk to you after the election. That's whole food. 
Hope is hopeful. You sell holes, hope. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know, if you if you're running holes, you got to sell them hope. And the Democrats is treating y'all like hoes. Look, we love your plan. We talk about it after you come back out them streets. That money. Feed them some feed them some whole food. We got to you know what I'm saying? Black folks is on a high whole food diet when it comes to dealing with these motherfuckers. No more. We got to stop. I'm working with black mayors around the nation. Y'all can read that uh, yourself. Will he work with Diddy in the future on their agendas? Y'all gone, y'all gone, because for those that don't know, uh, Diddy is starting, uh, uh, he's trying, well, he's financing, let's say, financing putting together a black political party now a lot of people are like well but the timing but the timing but the timing sometimes people kill me you know what i'm saying it's like yo shit happens shit happens i'm frustrated i got i got maybe a million dollars to spend i'm frustrated i need to create something i gotta do something Rather than being like, damn, that's a good idea. But yo, check this out. Have you thought about some of y'all, some of y'all, some of y'all that had have, have access? Because some see, it's like we're six degrees, we're six people away from knowing everybody. So somebody in your circle know somebody that could get you, especially if you have a big enough platform, in touch with one of these individuals. Be like, yo, 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 the black party piece is a good idea. And I think that you you're right to advertise it now. You know what I'm saying? And you, you're right to speak what you're speaking if that's what you honestly feel, right? But how serious are you about it and what investment are you willing to put up right now to show the people that you're serious about this party because we don't want to just, we don't want to do this um, vote or die shit. You remember, because right after the vote or die shit, everybody just disappeared, Right? just saying just saying so if this that type of shit no if it's not boom what's the investment where you putting the money at so that people know that this shit is on and popping november 10th right because the family please understand the election is is not the end for us it's a new beginning so you know Actually, right now, you should do your vote and get your rest because we're going to have four years of fighting regardless of who get in the White House. We got one who's who, but both of them blatant liars. Both of them. So we're going to have to fight. Hey, we didn't take care of the black people. We took care of the black people. And you're going to have you're going to have you're going to have their uh, I guess they call them shields. Their, I call them shields. You know what I'm saying? Because they going to stand in front of them. They did what they were supposed to do. You don't see the legislation for people of color. They did for us. See, Brother Hatim and them don't know what they talking about. They did for us. They put it right there in the bill for color people. Humpbacks. And people with extremely big toes. Cross-eyed people and everything. We right there. You don't see it. So, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm so sick of us falling for the... We fall for the okiest, dokiest shit all the time. Why? Why? Damn. All right, family, I'm about to get up out of here. Let's see if I got any other news posted. All right, Dr. Kelsey, we put Dr. Kelsey on yesterday. All right, put the engagement for shares. Thank you. Thank you for sharing Doc's stuff. Now, um, his, uh, you could you could find uh, his first book that he released with us on MariebaKelsey.com. And the second one is BabaKelsey.com. So go and check out um, Dr. Kelsey's work. Because like I said, man, family, we, we got to start showing appreciation for the knowledge that we have accumulated in our community. 
and uh, you know, but it's kind of hard to get people to move, and that's cool. I'm gonna work on mastering that. I'm gonna master that part of the game. You master what you doing. All right. So this is brother Hot Tim. Um, uh, I am out. I'm gonna upload and cut some of this shit. But anyway, y'all have a great day. family yo thank you for joining us right and i'm thrilled to announce the fact that we are now releasing our first free e-course come and learn about your journey see some of the stuff we do come and join the tribe the tribe up with us and check out the free e-course we'll make sure that the url pop up right about here and it'll probably be somewhere in here Check us out, family, because we are building. Come and learn about Gianni's journey, and let's build together. One of the most frequent questions that I get is, where are the children, and why, yourself, why you call yourselves the children of the sun? I am a genius. My ancestors were geniuses. My ancestors have made me a genius in all that I think, say, and do. I must declare myself a genius. I am a genius. Whenever I am myself, I practice my geniusness and do great things. All my thoughts, choices, and deeds must express my geniusness. I am a genius. My decision must always be in the best interest of myself, my family, my people, and my God. Only then will I and everyone I know know that I am a genius. I am a genius. At all times, my geniusness must reflect my culture. My geniusness must serve my God. My geniusness must make me be one in love and harmony with my family. My geniusness must protect my people. Yes. yes, at all times I must demonstrate excellence because I am a All right, it's time for the Toast family. Come on out. Let's get it. Trying to be right. Take the toast. Media GNJ. Media. We are doing the daily.
African women, but the most important goddesses were black, not just for the African now, in the civilization of the Greeks. The Greek was so profoundly affected by the Africans that the goddess of chastity was a black woman, Artemis. The goddess of wisdom was a black woman, Minerva. The goddess of beauty was a black woman, Diana. And many of their great mythological figures which were critical to the vision of history, the history of the Greeks in the Odyssey, the woman who draws, who has the power to draw Odysseus and all his crew into her, is Circe, who is represented as a black woman with African features on the Greek vases. The woman who helps Jason win the Golden Fleece is a black woman, Medea. The woman who marries Perseus, the Greek hero. What is a lion without his pride? What is a whale without his pie? What is a monkey without his truth? What is a wolf without his pack? The answer is very simple. They are the same thing that a human being is without a try. Pray.